Welcome to the stream. No, I'm not a Minecraft YouTuber for you guys. I'm not a Minecraft YouTuber. As you can see, I've been looks maxing. Flashbang holy. Oh, come on. It's not that bad. He's just a baby. Okay. Shaved scrotum too? Question mark? <laughs> what? Who the f*** is this? I'm never escaping it, bro. Why is everyone... Is it that bad? Do I look that bad? Like a hairless cat. Okay, that's a little... A little strong. Now let's talk about what we're doing today. We have been planning a stream for a very long time, which I'm excited for because normally on the planning process, I have so much planning. I'm normally involved in everything. Today, however, my mods have came up with a ton of questions about me. So I am going to go against you, the viewers, to see who knows me better. Is it you or is it me? And of course, I can't host this. So to do that, I brought my great friend Pete Premier 2 to host this quiz. All right, I'll call Pete. Hello, hello. What's up? What's up? How you doing? I'm sorry. The voice doesn't match the face. Who okay. <laughs> hey, uh, I left it out of this patch. Oh, God. Well, I like the way it looks. And don't you let anybody in chat say, hey, you look 12 or who's this kid? Don't let him get to you, man. Don't don't you worry about it. Okay. Okay. If you when you say that, I feel much better about it now. Now put Connor on the stream. Okay. <laughs> what I do have is I have uh, the scores up here and I have the questions, which I don't have control over. You have control over this, right? Ah, uh, yes. It's the only fatal flaw of this entire stream. <laughs> you have yeah. control over everything. Oh, no. You gave the guy with the least technical ability and the greatest mistake probability to host and control the scores and the stream. So good job. Okay. I'm going to have to actually, I realized I, I'm not going to be able to look at my stream because chat's voting. So I'm actually not going to see anything now. Are you ready to start? I guess, yeah. I mean, let's just let's do it. Let's get into it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's episode of Who Wants to Be a Connor? That's right. It is the one and only episode where we pit your collective intelligence and memory of our good friend C Dog VA against himself. He is going to try and recall all of the amazing things and not so amazing things that he's done in his life. You may know him as the Dolphin Rizzler or perhaps a YouTube Titan, a member of the Trash Taste podcast or just a monkey with a bunch of friends. Personally, I know him as the guy who couldn't quite live up to the legend in a crane game against this host. However, it's not about me. It's about this man. Ladies and gentlemen, Sea Dog VA! Wow, thank you. Who could have guessed that we'd be here today? Uh, what an honor to be here and compete against the other fellow Con Airs. <laughs> Con Air. <laughs> <laughs> Are we ready to go? Yeah, let's do it. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, question number one. Connor and Mouse have played a lot of video games together. Oh, wait, actually, I get to control everything. Wow, this, this is really cool. Wait, yeah, oh, wait, yeah, you get to show the question. <laughs> All right. <laughs> what is the first game that they played together on stream? Was it Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes, Fortnite, <laughs> It Takes Two, or mm -hmm. Minecraft? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I, I, I knew this one, actually, without uh, needing to uh, hear the questions. This one I'm pretty confident on. I mean, I'd, I'd like to think I got the first one right. So, I mean, it's, it's the easiest, right? I'm not going to say that you would disappoint Mouse and her legions of yeah, amazing... Yeah, Mouse would kill me if I didn't know. She'd get really angry. The, the answers are coming in nice and pretty heavy. So, okay. Connor, they've let their answer be known. What is your answer? I would like to lock in A, keep talking and nobody explodes. Keep talking and nobody explode. And the correct answer is Yay! very good. Well done, my friend. Okay, you are on the board, <laughs> as is chat. No! For monkey, score one for chat. Now, look, we're starting with some easy questions. We're letting you yeah. guys roll into it. I've prepared some curveballs personally. So Ooh, don't oh. think it's going to be all the way this easy. Now, question number two, which I fully expect you to possibly make a mistake on. No, what? Connor <laughs> has no, no, many no, no, mods no, no, in his no, channel, no. but he doesn't even know who they are. No, to prove no. this, who is not one of his <laughs> Twitch moderators. That's so mean. Hazat, SWG, no. Foster, Kitten, <laughs> Seura, or Nesfruta, PH. <laughs> mods. This is so BM to ask me this. I'm, I'm very confident in this one, at least. I'm pretty sure D 
Nesfruta PH? That's not a moderator. I don't know who that is. The answer is okay. Nesfruta PH. Very good. You have won nice. the people's creation and fame forever by knowing at least who helps you the most. The next question is this. Booby VT is a famous VTuber. And as his okay. loyal peasant subjects, he expects us to know everything about him, including mm -hmm. his birthday. I know this one. Huge booby fan, so I, I'm pretty confident about this one. As the booby fans around the world have already answered, they're in. What do you think it is? Lock it in. It's B April 1st. Very, very good. It is April 1st. We press forward. It's scores tied three to three. Speaking of booby, what is booby's favorite <laughs> blood type to drink? Um, yeah, I think I know. Why don't you go ahead and lock in your answer then? Okay, okay. Uh, I'm going to go with CO negative, I think. The correct answer is CO negative. Well done. Uh, yeah, nice, nice, nice. Connor has raised a lot of money for the IDF. How much yeah. in total has Connor raised for them through the charity platform Tiltify? Not a lot of mention of the other participants in that <laughs> raising. Thing, but was it one million two hundred and eighty thousand one hundred and ninety six dollars? <sighs> Was it one million one hundred and eighty nine thousand four hundred and fifty four dollars, two million four hundred and seventy seven thousand eight hundred and ninety three dollars, or seven hundred and fifty thousand two hundred and sixty nine dollars? I think they could have been really cruel and they could have put uh, all those numbers very close together. But I know it's in the one point one or two range. Three. Oh wait. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. I actually don't know. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna say a a. Is A? Is it A? I'm very sorry that it's not C, but it is A! Yes! I, I didn't know. That is a lot. Of course, I knew that without even looking as oh. part of... Sorry, Connor raised... Let me see. Now, I'll let <laughs> Van Gang and Mr. Broad know. And, uh, oh, we'll see no. I didn't write these. Th don't shoot the messenger. Five oh, to five. Terrible. The next question is this. Connor is known to be quite unlucky when it comes to winning Trash Taste Special. <laughs> Which Trash Taste Special did he actually win? Was it the Figure Special? The mm -hmm. Cycle Special? The Drifting Special? Or the Murica Special? special <laughs> okay first of all there's more than one answer here okay technically you know the cleanest win i ever had was the murica special d the correct answer is d the murica special Very good. okay but we all know that i won the cycling special too this next question is my personal contribution i added this question so i'm gonna make this one worth double points all right okay. This is a two-point question. Connor has had many odd jobs in addition to streaming and being a YouTuber. Okay. What has he not done? Okay. Has he not been a McDonald's staff worker, a lifeguard, okay. a voice actor, mm -hmm. or a barista at a cafe? All right, I'm going to say D, a cafe barista. I've never been one as much as I want to be. You are correct. Although you you do like your coffees. I think you'd be a good one. And so, so? is chat. I, I oh. thought maybe, I guess when you stream as long as you have, you just let everybody know everything, huh? There are no secrets. I just open chat and they're like, C. All right, f*** off chat. All right, okay. <laughs> Another one of my Pete questions. Mm. Connor has played a lot of games on Twitch, but what has... Has he played the most? Apex Legends, Chess, Jump King, or I'm Only Sleeping? <laughs> Oh, dude, I I actually don't know this one. Although I have played a lot of chess, I don't think it's chess because it's normally in, you know, it's never those 12 hour sessions. Jump King, it definitely could be. Dude, it could be Apex or sleeping. I, I genuinely don't know. Um, I'm going to just go with Apex. I think it would be sad to say that sleeping is my most played category on Twitch. Moment of truth. The answer is... Okay. Oh! 
Yay. I put in a lot of hours in those first few years. So here's the thing. I feel proud because my question did have the biggest disparity of like, most of these have been landslides. But that means yeah. as a teacher, I've still got it. I still have some <laughs> tricks up my sleeve. Just to okay. put this into some context, numbers wise, because I thought this would be interesting. Okay, okay. You have played I'm Only Sleeping for 97 hours. Wow. That's a lot of sleeping. Uh, your third most played title is chess at 106 okay. hours. Jump King at 118 hours. And Ooh. Apex Legends, you clocked in at exactly 10% of your streaming time on this platform, 321 hours. Holy, I've played that, what? You also played a ridiculous amount of team fight tactics in Elden Ring, but Elden Ring didn't count because you were just fighting the first boss. Okay, well. The next question. During a stream, there is always one <laughs> who tries to revive the French Empire. Okay. Who is it? I don't need to see the I don't need to see the prompt. It's C Emma Nutella 58. So the next question is this. We all know Connor is an OG anime YouTuber. But when did he really start his YouTube channel? Was it the 11th of February, 2014? The 3rd of February, 2013? The 7th of March, 2016? Or was it around my generation, the 1712? Why is February 1712? I did ask Cubi to remove some of the ones that are obviously impossible, but we missed one. <laughs> okay, yeah, sure. I was preoccupied with hitting the Nene and the Harlem Shake in 1712. Uh, I'll say A. The A, 11th of February. Is the 11th of February, 2014, and Connor <laughs> takes the lead. The next okay, question. Okay, okay. Connor has quite memorable username of Dog VA. But being from Virginia aside, where did the C Dog part <laughs> okay. come from? Okay, this is interesting. It was a childhood nickname from his friends. He wanted an easy to find YouTube channel name. It was to replace his cringy Xbox username. Mm. Or he had that dog. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I know the answer to this one. Okay. Well, why don't you go ahead and lock it in? It's not a childhood nickname that my friends gave me. I wish. I don't know why they would do that. Uh, it wasn't an easy to find YouTube channel name. And I, it sadly wasn't because I had that dog in me. It's because I wanted to get rid of my cringy Xbox username. Uh, so C. You are correct, my friend. As you guys know, you know, the Xbox, getting your handle was one of the most important things that you could have, you know, in yeah, middle yeah, school yeah. or high school or college or wherever, right? I went to my cousin's house for a big party and mm. her boyfriend, who was a really great guy, he was like, yo, dudes, you guys play like Xbox? We're like, yeah, man. He was like, can I, uh, can I join your guys' squad? And I was like, sure, here's my gamer tag. I was like, yeah, just send me an invite when we get home. We'll, we'll lock it in and play. And he was like, okay. His name was, you have to replace the letter E with the number three, okay? His okay. name was Hyman Destroyer, which is the worst, and he's dating my cousin. That's ridiculous. So I had to file a complaint on him every single day for three months. And finally, he must have gotten like a letter from Xbox that says, you can't have this. And he changed it to Spray Fart Drip, which is slightly better, but still awful. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, what was going on in Kansas, man? That's, that's... He was from Missouri. I'm safe. In 2022, mm. Connor went on a tour across the United States. Which mm -hmm. of these cities did they not have a show in? Was it Nashville, Boston, Orlando, or... Indianapolis. <laughs> I'm sure that your laugh did not in any way, shape, or form give away a potential answer. <laughs> uh, no, 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 not at all, not at all. I, think I, I actually remember all of the cities I went to, I think, and the answer that we didn't go to is D, Indianapolis. Yeah, thank, yeah, okay, thank you. Uh, mainly because <laughs> I, I remember we had this conversation. We had so many shows, and Indianapolis was originally on there. Sorry to people from uh, Indiana now. We mainly didn't go because I was like, no, nah, I'm good. I, I, I've, I've already been. I don't want to go again. You've already been? So you thought, ah, I don't need to go back. I'm all right. Let's just cancel. Well, yeah, basically, I was like, man, I don't really want to go back to Indiana again. Uh, and as people from Indiana will attest, uh, it sucks. Um, <laughs> I asked to, like, the, my Uber driver. I was like, hey, uh, where do I go eat? And he goes, uh, Shake Shack? 
Jack? And I was like, there's only restaurants? He's like, we got one. I was like, what? He's like, we got one. It's a steakhouse. When I say that, everyone from Indianapolis knows what I'm talking about when I say the steakhouse in Indianapolis, which is, which should never be a thing. See, this guy said it. Look, he said it. St. Elmo's. They all know it. So, all right. Well, hey, look, if uh, honestly, uh, I'm surprised <laughs> you went to the Midwest at all. As a Midwesterner, I really appreciate you skipping Indianapolis. They can go to hell. I don't really mind. <laughs> As a man of culture, what is Connor's favorite piece of culture? Okay, 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 yeah. Sleepless. A Midsummer Night's Dream. Mother knows breast, kudo ino, or masterpiece. I, I I know the answer, 100. Tell us. Uh, yeah, it's D masterpiece. Uh, I'm seeing a chat thinks it's Mother knows breast, but it's actually masterpiece. That's the thing, right? Is that you've you've once again outsmarted your own people. Sorry, chat. Uh, Connor takes the lead, or does he? Because he is wrong! What? My mods are trolling me! What the heck? Okay, well, look. Let's see what I have on my desk, right? This is what I keep on me at all times. A volume of masterpiece. The point being, never leaves my side. Well, I've never heard of any of this sh I thought they were all made up, but... <laughs> all of them are real ones, by the way. Connor is often called a monkey by his Twitch chat. What is the official term for a group of monkeys... <laughs> In the wild, a degenerate, <laughs> a a pack, Floridians, okay. or a troop. Oh, I don't know this one. Yeah, I don't know. I think I know. I I would have guessed the correct answer. Yeah, I, I feel like what I would have guessed is wrong because it feels too simple. So I'm gonna go with um. I'll lock in D, a troop. The correct answer is a troop. Very good. Very good. Why did the mods write two clearly fake answers? I don't know. <laughs> Why would mods? Mods, this is not how you write questions. And I don't even understand. They put A and C as the same thing. I'm kidding, Florida people. <laughs> they're not. They're not. Connor has done a lot of wacky weekends with his boyfriend, Chris Broad. Which one of these wacky weekends has the most views? on oh. YouTube. I tried Japan's craziest bungee jump inside Osaka's worst love hotels featuring at abroad in Japan. I drove to Japan's snowiest town, winter road trip, and I tried Japan's most insane noodle challenge. I know it's not A, because I remember that video not doing well when it first came out. I think it did okay now. Uh, B, uh, this is my video, and it got demonetized and age restricted, and so it did very badly. But I think it's D. I think it's D. I tried Japan's most insane same noodle challenge. The answer is inside no. Osaka's worst love hotels featuring abroad in Japan. You are wrong. Wait, Osaka, wait. No, I was thinking of the wrong place. Ah. First of all, sorry about your loss there. Is the only one that's on your channel inside Osaka's worst love hotels and the other three are Chris's? No, the top two are mine, the bottom two are Chris's. And I confused because I've done so many videos on love hotels. I confused the location. Wait, my one has the most? Oh, I, I can rub that in on Chris when I see him next week. Oh, another love hotel? What the fuck? Why don't you do something good with your channel? <laughs> when I took you to a beach and made you sleep in the sand. That's actually 10 million. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, there you go. You, your video clears and chat officially takes, takes the, the lead. lead. All right, now we've already answered the first game that you played with Iron Mouse, but what was Connor and Mouse's first interaction with each other? Was it the lewd cast podcast, voice acting invitation on Twitter, Minecraft, or was it simply lurking on each other's Oh my street? God. What's it going to be? Lock it in. I think it's D, lurking on each other's stream. For your sake, I hope you're right because you don't want to mess with democracy. And the answer is okay. D. Okay. You look each other's streams. Okay, Very good, good, good. I'm safe. I'm safe. You're safe for now. The next question is: What is Connor's favorite Welsh word? Lamfer Pwilogwingwi La Grocer Chawadan Trebenelble. Uh, frothy coffee. Popty ping. Mochin. I am part Welsh. I just haven't studied it in a while. <laughs> yeah, mochin. Yeah, that's a that's an interesting word. It's called mochin pig. Ah, uh, uh, sorry, I had a I have ping, allergy. That's correct. Frothy coffee. I I don't actually. I've never heard anyone call frothy coffee. Uh, a. I think. You should have trusted your instinct, and for the first time, and who wants to be a con air, both people were wrong. <laughs> How do they know my favorite word? Frothy coffee. <laughs> is that a real thing? I want to Google that right now. A fun translation is frothy coffee cappuccino. I've never heard of this in my life. Connor 
has talked to a lot of Japanese people through Apex Legends. What is the name of Connor's first Japanese okay. online friend? Is it Kyo-chan, Tinjo, mm -hmm. Nidimaru, or Zentreya? <laughs> Obviously not D. You know, we all know Zentreya. Yeah, the Japanese streamer. Hello. Tenjo is a guy I met. He took me to a Kenyan bar, I think. And Lily Mara, obviously, we played a lot with. But I think it's Kyochan was the first person I made friends with. I think it was Tenjo first, actually. I think Kyochan was after Tenjo. Well, you have another example where we have split. So okay. one of you is going to get a point. Is it going to be the monkey to tie this game, or will it be chat to take a two point lead? Well, the answer mm. is Kyochan! Come on. Connor is wrong once again. You got that one wrong, but at least you have fond memories of Tenjo and Kyochan. So oh, I didn't know if it was Kyochan first or Tenjo. F this is something I think you're gonna struggle with. The question is: not only does Connor have a YouTube and Twitch channel, but to the surprise of the man himself, he also has a Discord server. What year did Connor create this Discord server? I've never seen you in there once. <laughs> I'm going to assume you found out about this today. Is it 2015, 2016, 2018, or 2021? Help your weebs out and give us your answer in a moment. Um, oh, geez. Listen, <laughs> I used to be active on this thing all the time. And then I realized it's sucking the soul out of me and I had to moderate disputes between between uh, Minecraft Boy 69 and uh, a, a game of 15. Please don't out my Discord. Sorry, name. I didn't mean to. Sorry. It's either like right at the start of 2016 or like December 2015. 16 would be the safe bet, but I say f it. We're going 15. Let's roll the dice. Let's see. And we have a judgment. Chat and Connor once again no. disagree <laughs> on the outcome. No. It is between 2015 and 2016, but. Which of you was correct? The answer is... Oh, no. And Connor is wrong once again. How do they know this? How do they know? Because they're in there. They know. It I'm going to check right now. When did I make the server? When is it? I'm pulling it up. Well, right now, it says May 2016. So you were pretty oh. far. So we're moving on to the next question. Which one of the following channels has the second most subscribers? Connor Dog, C Dog VA, Trash Taste, or uh -huh. C Dog Vods? So I, I don't <laughs> actually know the answer to this one. But um, I think it's trash taste. I think it's trash taste. Connor has spoken. And once again, we're at the crossroads of fate. Two different answers. Only one is correct. And the answer to this question is trash hey. taste. He is correct, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. How did they get that one wrong? I Ooh. think they, you know what? Give them a little bit of credit. They believed in the power of Connor Dog. That's true. I mean, Connor Dog's a great channel that you should all go subscribe to right now. You're, you're back in the winning we're ways. There. We're getting there. We're getting there. Now, we're getting back. Next question. Let's do it. Double points. Oh, shit. Is it a Pete question? Not a Pete question. I just think it's a fun one. Connor is definitely one who can take in his alcohol responsibly. During his <laughs> drunk truck simulator stream, what number reading did he reach on the breathalyzer no, by the end of the stream? Remember. Point 0.12, point 0.21, point 0.08, or point 0.14? Gonna be <laughs> tough to remember. He had a few that he knocked back. I think I had like seven beers. Well, well, beers. well. Once again, we meet old John Barleycorn. That's a reference to alcohol from the night when I grew up. From what century? <laughs> It's 1712. <laughs> 1712. I remember then. That's when I made my YouTube channel. Do you have your answer, Mr. C Log VA? I'm trying to, okay, I think to answer this and to remember correctly, I need to remember the regional drunk driving limits because I, I know roughly where I was at in comparison to them, in, rel in relation to them. I think it was A, I was definitely in the ones. So I think it was 0 0.12. I, th I don't think it was 0 0.14. So I'm saying A, I'm locking in A. Well, see, now that's the thing about alcohol, you think you know something, but you're not quite sure, and mm -hmm. the memory is a little hazy. That's true. And That's why I don't remember. <laughs> found out that both of you are wrong. No. It is point one four. Chat thought you were legally dead at point two one. <laughs> Here's the image to prove it. Oh my gosh! Look at it. Shameful. I think that this next one is really easy, but I just think it's humorous that they thought they could ask it. One memorable thing about a streamer is their catchphrase or how they greet their view without fail okay. what are the first words that come out of connor's mouth when he starts his stream is it
it. Yeah. Hey guys, Sea Dog here. <laughs> ah yes, my my iconic catchphrase is it. What is up, my beautiful weebs? <laughs> Do I sound like a like a Discord molester? <laughs> Can you say, hey, God, what's up, kittens? Can you do that thing? Ah, oh, what is up, my kitten? <laughs> no, no, it's awful. <laughs> All right, next up is gamers or incoherent <laughs> screaming and monkeys. <laughs> there you go. I went the extra distance and embarrassed myself on your behalf. Thank However, you. there's only one answer. Uh, yeah, it's the gamers. You both know it. They're already pouring it in. It is gamers. Mm -hmm. uh, I would have liked it to have been, hey guys, the dog here. <laughs> we, we, uh, I, I just, I'm going to do that next stream, next stream. Now, this next one, very interesting, especially coming from someone who likes this genre very much Ooh. of gaming. Despite numerous games that have fantastic storylines and lore, what is the one thing that says he can't be bothered to do in a game? that he says, <laughs> follow instructions, care about the characters in the game, read, or watch the cutscenes. Okay, I would have said grind, but that isn't here. So this is tough, because I think all of them. <laughs> okay, but there's one I feel like I gravitate towards more naturally. Um, A, follow instructions. <laughs> well, as many of your viewers, I also watch your stream, and you mm -hmm. drive me insane. It's literally all of this shit. The f is wrong with you? Why can't you just f any of them read, care about, watch? Uh, I, I can't, hey, I, I sometimes do it. Okay, I, I care about the characters. I read, and I watch the cutscenes. And I follow instructions. Okay, I don't need to follow instructions. So this is a tough one. Well, I, don't I know also did I say all of them when I was contemplating, did I not? So did chat. You know what? Uh, you guys are right, and I'll let my fury subside for a moment. <laughs> but for God's sakes, you're trampling on my childhood. Listen, I did I not play all of Final Fantasy VII and listen to all the cutscenes and read all of this? Well, you gave Ketchy Ke a. Oh God, don't remind me a of your more accurate Scottish accent. Oh God. Oh, hey, oh God. Lads, it's me, cut shit. How you doing? Pass me the fing haggis and bagpipes. We're going for a fing night out. By the way, I'm a fing spy, you dumb. All right, I docked you a point. That's, that's as much as I can take. Minus one. <laughs> Only a point. I betrayed your entire bloodline. <laughs> all right. All right. I think this is an interesting phrasing. So I, I wonder where this okay. would get. <laughs> what the what is this quest? <laughs> it is safe to say that Connor is the whitest thing since sliced bread. Out of curiosity, Connor has taken a DNA test for uh, one of his old videos. What? was the most prominent uh -huh. result. Were you British, Irish, Scottish, or did you kind of fit in to all of the above? That is interesting. I remember roughly what the answers were. Scottish, wouldn't it be British technically as well? I'll say a British, because I don't think I had any Irish. I think D would be a safer answer, but I'll say let's go British, A. Once again, Connor has opted to live a life of danger. Will it yeah. pay off? You've each chosen a different answer. The the answer is all of the above. How do they keep it doing this? Oh God, it's look at me. Damn, yeah, hey, yeah, I guess so, I guess they're right. I would like to point out one thing. You've opted to live dangerously and go against the safe answer three mm. times. In those three times, you've been right zero of them. Uh, some might say that, yeah. Connor has been quite okay. athletic. Which outdoor okay. sport has Connor not participated in during an IRL stream? Is it sandboarding, skiing, paddleboarding, or skydiving? I can answer this one. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like if you were going to ask me this question, you'd throw in something that I definitely like would be more inconspicuous. You know what I mean? I know. It's like, <laughs> which one of these isn't kind of done? Talk to his friends. <laughs> Uh, have a drink with Pete. Rob a bank. <laughs> We're all losers on that one. So we move on. Uh, I'm going to give you a chance. I'm going to give you one chance. If you can get the next two questions right without chats, they're not going to vote. I'm no. just going to give you a, a double gauntlet, but you have to answer immediately. And I'm not going to tell you the four okay. possibilities. Yeah. All right. What does Connor consider as the most expensive yet memorable investment from the recent TwitchCon? My three sh white walls, I guess. Three sh white walls was correct. It yeah. was the IRL, our place. You got to get this one right to get one more point. According yeah. to one of our 
partner's videos on his main channel. What is the most money Connor has spent on JoJo merch? Well, I was like, I think it's like ten thousand dollars overall, like five hundred dollars on a JoJo suit. He is correct. It was ten thousand yeah. dollars. So we're gonna give him a point because I I feel like you guys would have easily cleared both of those, and we're gonna scam you guys out. That's fine. I, he's trying to make it close. I appreciate it. It's unfair, but that's how these these games <laughs> often play themselves out. Damned. Listen, if you want to make it back, I'll tell you what. Here right. is a double point Ooh. chance. Connor has been known to make quite a few questionable purchases when it comes to reviewing cosplay. How many cosplay videos has Connor created? 21, 24, 11, or 29? Have I really done more than 10? I think I know the answer. Well, you better let me know because chat has spoken. I'll say C11. Okay. Let's the answer find out. is 21 videos oh. of cosplay. I've made that many. Listen, I tried to help you, chat. I knew he was going to get that wrong, and you fumbled it. You called me a scam artist. You had it in your hand. I gasped at 21. I was like, I know way it's 21. Holy sh**. Nobody gets a point there, but your time is not up yet. You still got some chances. Okay, okay, okay. Connor's naming sense is important. Impeccable. During his Pokemon Nuzlocke, what was not a name he used to name his Pokemon? Oh, no. Giga Chad, Protag, Copium, or Karen? <laughs> oh, no. I would use all of these. This is so hard. This is this is a hard question. What the f***? I must have used Giga Chad. I don't know who got it. I don't know who it was. Karen, <laughs> I have some vague recollection that I think I named someone Karen. And then Copium? I don't know if I'm doing like 500 Giga Brain trying to play here, trying to outsmart chat. I think it's Copium. Uh, I didn't name. I can tell you one thing. You and chat have once again diverged. They went pro tag, didn't they? I know that. They, they went pro tag. Of course they did. You, Connor, are correct! It is Copio! Yo! I can't believe I remember that! Here's what we got as the image. Oh, my name is Copium? Oh, that's what I named myself! I got a little bit of a, a problem here. I got, I got cat. <laughs> He's ruining your hosting ability. Double points! Mm -hmm. Out of the 20 videos he has made, he lost to me. How many Crane Game videos have included special guests? 12, 9, 18, or 20? Wow. That's a lot. I would say, I think it's C, 18, because there's two videos where I did it alone, and then I think the rest were with guests. And both of you are correct! It is 18. How does chat know that? What the heck? So we're going back to double points. So this one, I had a personal, uh, I'm attached to it at least, because at least I, I'm familiar with it. Nice. Kind of a tricky question. What was Connor's prize for breaking the most Kawada tiles <laughs> during the first part of the adventure? Family Mart socks, a Welsh scarf, the first choice of betting, <laughs> or absolutely nothing. Just a total badass. <laughs> to the d dismay of you, it was the first choice of betting. Which is total f***ing bullshit! Did and you, did you set up this question just so you could complain? It's so stupid! <laughs> I won nine challenges and got socks that you took later! I was gonna say, I also got the Welsh scarf. I gave, I gave it back to you. <laughs> and it was ridiculous. Yeah, you gave them back to me after your soaking wet feet. I still use those family, the very same pair. I still use them to this day. Those family mark socks that I stole from you. That was wrong. So you've tied it up. Yo! Yeah, I I, uh, I wrote that one. Yeah, no, I know. Because you. I the moment I saw it, I was like, you just want to complain. <laughs> In 2019, Connor decided that life was more fun with blonde hair. How many videos did he post with the head full of golden locks? Oh, God. 5, 13, 21, oh, stupid. or 30? I have no idea. I have no idea. You know, I, I I didn't really think much about it when I got my hair dyed. I just, that was around the time when I was like, wait, shit, I'm balding. And then, <laughs> and then I really noticed I was balding after that bleach. So if you consider that a mistake, how many videos did you do with this mistake? Quite a lot, because I used to upload, I used to upload quite often. I'll say, I'll say 21, I'll say 21. 21. Chat has chosen one answer that is different. No. The answer is 21. <laughs> Yo! How did I get that right? You guys got to figure it out because we only have a couple more questions left. But the Cut. next one's a tough one. Let me think for one second. Hold on a minute. I'll tell you what. Connor, you sit this one out. I'm going to give them a chance. Okay. 
Sure. All right, chat, to get back in the game. While in America, Ludwig took Connor willingly by the hand to many fast food hotspots to see which ones were the best of the best. Which restaurant did the duo not go to? Shake Carl's Jr. Johnny Rockets. Fat Burger. Get your votes in now. Dude, so I love how those people in chat be like, don't answer if you don't know. <laughs> They're like actually trying to seriously do that. I love this. This is close. The chat can't decide as well. They are very neck and neck. Connor, do do you want to do the honors of telling them if they were right? They have said fat burger. Was that the correct answer? I don't think it was. Was the answer their second choice, Johnny Rockets? I don't think it was either. I think it was, I think it was B, Carl's Jr. The answer is Carl's <laughs> oh, I remember Jr. this. Oh, no. We went to a fat burger and the, that's where the, the guy, we asked him if this was the best burger in California or the, and he was like, no. And Johnny Rockets, I remember it was just like, we actually sat down in the restaurant. And what better way to close out this quiz than to celebrate Celebrate Connor's achievements. What is Connor's most viewed video of all time with nearly 7 million views? Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I, I know the answer to this one. Okay. So can you uh, can you mute me for a minute? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Mute you to myself or the stream? Uh, to you. Okay. I have to just leave the room. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's all right then. I'll come back in 10 seconds. <laughs> okay, okay, wait. Okay, guys, you got 10 seconds, all right? Is the answer the following? I rented a Japanese boyfriend for a day. I went to Japan's ear cleaning salon. I paid voice actors to dub JoJo scene with no context, or I tried dating in Japan with zero Japanese. Go now. Okay, come back! Come back! Come back! Cutter! Yeah! It's the f***ing, I paid five of voice actors to dub over JoJo. It's a sh video. I hate that it has so many views. You are correct, and so was chat, which means that right now, the score as tabulated is 39 to 38, and you are currently the winner. <laughs> Why do people just keep? Why do people keep spamming wide among us gay sex? Um. All right. Are you ready? This final question will be worth double points. Point, 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 point. The question is: What is the total runtime of all of the Sea Dog VA main YouTube channel? <laughs> Minutes. A hundred and one hours, fifty-seven minutes and forty-four seconds. Oh, I can't see the I can't see the things. Four minutes and six seconds. A hundred and fifteen hours, twenty-three minutes and two seconds. A hundred and seventeen hours, two minutes and thirty-six seconds. I'll be a I'll be a gentleman. I'll let chat have their guess first. And I'll go differently. Okay, so it was basically, I mean, nobody was going to guess it anyway. Chat, for some reason, either goes C or B. Why is that? Why do they want C or B? I don't understand. B for choke dog or C for C dog. What's the B for? <laughs> B bitch dog? Like, B I'll go for B then. If you don't believe in it enough, I'll go for B because you're all little bitches. <laughs> the answer is, despite we having some technical difficulties, was C for Choke Dog VA. It was, so it was what? 115 hours and 23 minutes and two seconds. I How, lost. However, I feel that was a tough one to end on, but I'm okay with you losing because you're a, you're a bitch dog VA. What the but, f How did I lose my own show? I well, paid I, everyone to be here. How did I lose a 50? This uh, Oh my gosh. I even let them choose first as well. God damn it. By a score of 40 to 39, the winner of Who Wants to Be a Con Air is the Shadows! Can't believe it. But I thank you. I really appreciate you hosting. Uh, no one else could have done a better job and obscure knowledge of Family Mart socks, feathery, and all you <laughs> lean. <laughs> you did a great job. Well, I appreciate that. And I hope that you guys have a continue another another 10 years of celebrating Sea yes. Dog VA and his amazing friends. And that was a ton of fun. Thank you, buddy. All right. Well, for this episode of Who Wants to Be a Con Air, I am signing off. Good night now. Take care, guys. Bye.